Woods. What is going on? Sorry I've been away, but we have had to take a reset on running. My back sort of just went into a crazy spasm for like two weeks. So every time I went to run, I could only manage about five, 10 minutes. And it would just spasm up and I'd be in agony and I couldn't lift my legs and I couldn't move. And I figured that's the way I'm sleeping. So I sleep like face down and I've been trapping like nerves in the back of my neck. And then that's then been reverberating. Is that the right word? Re anyway, give me an, a problem down the back of my lower back, which has then caused me not to be able to even run properly. So I've ran, also the treadmill broke again, brilliant. But we're out, we've been running nice and easy. I'm gonna go back to basics. Like Tony, Tony Stark says, it's back to hardware time, I think. I don't know, I'll find the quote and I'll put it. Anyway, um, I am in the Windflow 7s today. What a shoe. If you like the Pegasus 36, or you're gonna buy the Pegasus 37, have a think about these. They are amazing. And I mean amazing. They're like a beefy Pegasus 36. They've got more cushion on the full A zone unit. They've got like sort of the same sort of rocker style as like a Zoom Fly 3 and sort of a next percent. They've got a next percent sole um, kind of thing going on. <sighs> an amazing shoe. Anyway, I'm going to carry on with this run. I will see you all when we get back at the house. I'm sorry I've been away, but now I'm back for a little bit. Well, for as long as I'm back, I'll see you in a sec. Oh, that was one wet, wet run. Four miles, 28 minutes. Feeling good, enjoying it. Um, I'm gonna have some vitamin C, some vitamin D, and a coffee, and I'll speak to you in a sec. Oh, that was one wet, wet run. Four miles, 28 minutes. Feeling good, enjoying it. Um, I'm gonna have some vitamin C, some vitamin D, and a coffee, and I'll speak to you in a sec. What is up, ladies and gentlemen? So. You join me with my hard salsa drink. Um, just sitting chilling after a lovely day. Nice 30 minutes, well, 28 minutes. Feeling good, feeling fresh, happy to be back running properly. No pains, just had a boiling hot bath, which was amazing. And yeah, these shoes, the Windflow 7, they're amazing. They really are amazing. Just look at them, right? So you've got, like, this is a Cushlon sole and it's quite springy, it's bouncy. And what I was trying to say when I was out on the run about the like 4% thing, it's like got the, the I, don't, I don't know how to explain it, but it's similar tread, similar black pattern to like 4% and that, similar cutouts, like the shape. It's just a great shoe, it really is. There's a few creases coming because that's what happens with Cushlon. It gets very creased up, like the 36s, that after a few runs would just be creased city, but they are so bouncy and so responsive they just feel amazing. Like, they really do. They are quite heavy, but they, they, and you shouldn't really put them on the table because they're dirty. But, um, yeah, they're just a brilliant shoe. Like, it, they just seem to flow really well. I'll get you all the stats and stuff. I've only done about 20 to 30 miles max, so that's probably about 20. Um, and so far, I am so impressed with them, honestly. They're, they're like the Nike version of uh, uh, New Balance Beacon, basically. Like, they're just amazing. Um, and secondly, I'd like to apologise for being away for a while. I know I said last time I'll be back and stuff. I just sort of back spasms, different things just weren't working out and stuff. So I was just getting a bit like down in the dumps and stuff. And then obviously working from home and stuff, taking quite a lot of adjusting. I've got no routine. I've sort of jumped out of my routine. Um, and it's just been a struggle to get running and stuff. So today's video is not super long. I will see you all tomorrow. I will get a full review up of these hopefully by the end of next week because I will have done about 50 to 60 miles in them by then. And I'll let you all know. They're fabulous, but, and they are Nike's secret shoe. They're actually only 75 quid, if you look around. Um, and I think it's better than the Pegasus 37. I want to get the Pegasus 37 to try, but this is a far more responsive ride. Anyway, I'll see you tomorrow.